Hey guys, Super Horror Bro Mike here, and in today's video, we are playing Meatly's Storage World, a generic mascot horror game. This is actually by the Meatly who co created Bendy and the Ink Machine, and of course, the new Bendy and the Dark Survival. And he basically has created his own little funny game with him in it as a puppet trying to hunt us through these dark corridors. It's in the vein of other mascot horror games that we get a lot of these days. There's a lot of indie developers making their like small little mascot horror games of course and we even have the buy merch on the title screen. We can press M to buy merch which I'll try at the end of the video and see if that maybe goes to the Joey Drew Studios page or something. But either way, we're going to play this game today, guys. Now, it's not super serious. It is a bit of a joke game, and I'm definitely intrigued just to see what it's all about as a fan of the Meatly's work. So let's dive in. And let's see what Meatly Storage World is all about. Welcome to Happy Storage. I need to find my storage unit. Oh, wow. We, ro we run really fast, guys. We actually, like, run with purpose in this game. It's a bit hard to control, actually. What do we do? We've got, like, a button. We're holding, like, a button in our hand. Oh. Ah, oh, it opens doors. It goes green when we can open a door. Man, this is really dark. Toggle the flashlight with the right mouse button. There we go. Missing. Description, sweet and tasty. A donut. Nice. Happy storage. I hear the law is great in happy storage. There we go. Yeah, it's ticking. Oh, my God. What the heck? Oh, wait, what was that? Something is coming to get me. I can sense it nearby. This is so scary. Oh no, it's got me. Help, it's killing me. My arm fell off. How am I still writing this? Don't forget to buy bread later after work. <laughs> yeah, he's he's just having a lot of fun with his game. No, he, he's, he really doesn't care. Oh, is this sweet law? Locked. Looks like I need a code. We need a code for this. Okay. Let's have a look then. We're looking out for these little notes. I've got the flashlight on. Oh, something here. What's this? It's very important to write down your most personal thoughts and pin them to a wall for everyone to see. And make sure they are written like you are saying something else secretly so it seems deep. True, it's a uh, indie horror game staple. Do not worry. This is ketchup. Hey, good to know. Oh, what is this, guys? What is this? Is this a secret? Maybe? No? Maybe some of these storage rooms have something in and others don't, you know? We need to find that code though. This one's got nothing, just a few boxes. I get it, yeah, it's all the, the coloured doors that have something in. So four. That's the number we need, it's four. Oh my god, he's there, man! That's the Meatly, he's coming to get us. It literally is just the Meatly. Is he after us still? Nothing in there. Another missing donut. I think this is just made in Unity like Bendy, but it has a very different art style. There's another note here. Let's read it. Something secret is happening in this secret place. It was once a happy place, but now there are secrets. Secrets everywhere. Gosh, there are so many secrets, especially that one thing. That is so secret. I hope nobody is reading this. I've always heard to know about the secret. Interesting. Does our flashlight replenish if we have it off? That's what I want to know. One. Okay. We've got a one, guys. Wait. Okay, nothing there. We've got a one and a four so far. Oh man, the flashlight is so low now. Reading in dim light is bad for your eyes. Thanks for the uh, health warning there. Maybe we can hide in here for a bit. What the heck? I can hear whispering. Man, if our flashlight doesn't replenish, we're actually screwed at this point. I don't think it does. Guys, I don't think it replenishes. Five. So one five. Is something in here? Nope. This is nuts. I don't like how I haven't got any flashlight left. Four. 
four. So is it one five? Guys, I don't remember. I don't even remember where. Man, I don't know where to go. Oh, we've got no flashlight. We've got no flashlight now, guys. We're officially screwed. Oh my god, he's seen us, guys. Ah! He got us. He immediately got us, guys. Welcome to Happy Story. Oh no, we're gonna have to play it again. Okay, I think I got it this time, though. Basically, you want to use your flashlight, but only, um, only when you need to, right? So you basically you find the door, you check it. Done. That's all that you need to use it for. Now the meatly has entered the room. So we know the danger is near. I actually want to just find the meatly guys and uh, sort of get a better look at him now. You no, know, you get a better look at him as he chases us about. So let's try and find him. Let's try and locate him. Here he is. Look, here's the little puppet man. Oh my god, he's really fast. Wow. He's actually as fast as we are. Wow. Look at him go. Look at him run. Come on, come on. I'll give you a workout. You'll get some bacon after this. That's your reward. Some nice bacon. A nice bacon sandwich. Look, you can actually outrun him. Here he comes. Look, we're doing laps with the meatly. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> he's not that scary, is he? Let's be honest. Come on, then. I'll let you catch this. Whoa! Welcome to Happy Story. Right, that was actually kind of loud in my ears. <laughs> right, let's do a serious run now, guys. Let's dive back in. All right, guys. I'm going to go through this game until I find all the numbers, and then we'll see what's inside that chest. Not that I expect for it to be anything too exciting, because I think this is just a, a silly little game, isn't it? But at the same time, I do want to complete it, you know? Right, here's the chest. Locked. Looks like I need a code. Yep. Cool. Okay, four. We've got the first number. Right, we've lost one bar so far. We're still going. It's fine. I hate the fact you have to really balance your flashlight so much. It's nuts. You really don't get a lot to uh, to play with here. And I've only found one number. The numbers are like really well hidden. Oh, a one. Okay, it's two numbers down. I hope it immediately starts doing more of these. Like little short games. Because obviously, if they're not doing uh, Bendy as like a f episodic release anymore. Uh, they're going to obviously need games to fill out like that time in between and these kind of little games oh my god what the heck i've got jump scared by the five um yeah these little games are perfect just to fill out that space have we already got that four we've got it that's all the digits okay we finally got all the digits so now i just got to remember where the heck oh god he's coming now i just got to remember where the heck the storage locker was which had the uh, chest in it i think it was down there actually fair. Let's do it. Oh, the donut. We got the donut, guys. Yum. It's mine. Now I can exit this place. Sweet. Now, are we being chased at this point is a question. I don't know. But I'm getting out of here. Oh, it's blocked. Wait, who locked the door? <laughs> yeah, who locked the door? It's like bendy. It's all uh, boarded up now. So what do we do? I don't know. I don't know what the objective is. Oh, there's another exit. Let's go. Oh, no. What the heck? We fell down. Oh, there's the Meatly. Hey, how's it going? Looks demonic, doesn't he? Or zombified. Do you want a donut? Pre-order part two. <laughs> there we go. Imagine if this is a series. This was made in less than a day as a joke. Man, I wish I had the skills to do this in like less than a day. And that's it guys, the Meatly Storage World. That's actually kind of fun. It was actually really hard to like balance the flashlight so that, you know, I got enough time to actually look for the numbers. So this video actually took me about 20 minutes to record because I was looking everywhere and I just couldn't find where all the numbers were. But I eventually figured out you have to really balance the flashlight by just using it when you absolutely need it. 
and then that way you can actually get through the game. So it's kind of like got a nice balance to it, even though it is like a little joke game. If you guys enjoyed the look of this game, it is free to download and there is a link in the description below as always. I also want to check out the buy merch option. Let's just check this out. Oh, it's just a honk. You press buy merch and it just honks. I thought it might go to the Joey Drew Studios uh, like merch page, but it doesn't. So there we go, guys. That is the Meatly Storage Room World or Storage World. <laughs> A fun little game, a generic mascot horror game as it's described, and yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this video today. If you did, remember to leave a like, comment down below, and of course subscribe for more videos just like this one, and I will see you all on the next one.